Good morning, happy Sunday. Yeah, it's now Sunday morning. Um, obviously, I've just been for a run, bit of a workout, having my porridge and my coffee. Um, I'm not sure if this vlog's gonna be in two parts. So if it is, this is the start of part two. I think Friday and Saturday might have been quite long, so we might have split them. Saturday, we didn't really do much after we did some decorating, obviously stripped the walls had some dinner, watched um, Saturday Night Discussions, talking about Disney food. Oh, it really, 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 really makes me want to go back to Disney. That's a good strong coffee this morning. Um, God, all those places to go to eat. There's just too much choice. There's just far too much choice of where to go. Even off site, there is just some incredible places that I've never been to. But I want to go back to all the other places I've been to before. Bahama Breeze. Longhorn Steakhouse, Manny's Chop House, that's a brilliant one. Um, if you haven't seen it or heard of it, um, I think it was Timo Sullivan that went to uh, Manny's Chop House, so if you go and check out their vlog. Um, oh, the steaks from there are incredible. But yeah, it just really made me want to go back to Disney. Um, they're also talking about City Walk in the Universal. Not really stayed there much, not really been there much. Went to Bubblegum Shrimp many years ago, probably about nine years ago. Having my breakfast now. Gonna go and help there with some decorating. And then, I'm not sure what the rest of the day plans really, possibly go for a walk. Weather's not too bad this morning. It's quite mild, it's not raining, it's not really windy, so perfect for a walk, I suppose. Drag the kids out and then it's, yeah, I'm not sure. Let's see what the day holds. I'll take you with us. So I am still not dressed, I've had my breakfast. David is still busy painting, he needs to still go get some polyfiller from the shops and fill the walls in before we can paper, so it's going to take a long time. It's not going to be a 24 hours and amazing thing, but I am outside in the garden. I want to do something. This is the table I showed you the other week, and we got some of this. It's furniture stripper, so hopefully it's going to transform this back. This is what it says. Just from that to that. Let's give it a go and see what happens, eh? So it currently doesn't look any different, but I have put all the stuff, paint, one sealer, I don't know, on here. So it needs to take about half an hour, then I'm supposed to just be able to scrape it off and brush it off. Fingers crossed. This is not quite the finished product. There's still a few, obviously, things that need sorting. I really need to still do all the underneath. Um, but it's coming up quite good. If I had known that the jet wash would have blasted most of it away, I'd have saved myself like over an hour of scrubbing with a wiry brush. I know for the underneath. The underneath's only got one coat of paint on it, so I'm gonna use the varnishy paint remover thing and then just blast it off with a jet wash. Sounds like a fab idea. And then I'm going to sand it up a little bit because a few bits of wood here where it's got a bit of water damage and where I've just scrubbed with a wire brush hasn't helped. But the rest of it's in pretty good condition isn't it? Yeah. But mummy done a good job. Yep. So we're just heading out for, I've had a shower finally, heading out for a walk, quick coffee. Um, bedroom's coming along nicely, but they're such a mess. I think maybe we should have tackled one job at a time, but I just really want to get this start, start on this to see if I could make it work. So yeah, I need another day off. I'm in work tomorrow. Just on another little walk. Gone down the canal. It is so busy today. I think everybody's out because the weather is a lot nicer this morning. Oh, this afternoon, sorry. Crazy Grandad is with us. Emily and Harry are over there. Well, literally everybody is out. Then I'll grab a quick coffee. I'm gonna take you to Central, no, Walton Perk, which is where I've shown you before. 
But the park is heaving. to rain. Seriously, I can't believe it. We have a nice coffee by the way. The barge is really cute. But we've come out. It's been sun it's been a lovely morning, lovely day. And now it's peeing it down. I left my table in the garden drying out and I left the washing hanging up for the first time this year. Bad mistake. So it was nicely line dried and now it's all wet. Typical, absolutely typical. The sun was out an hour ago, and now we've come out. We need when you think it turn out, and it's yeah. peeing it down. We are home from our walk. I once say I saved the washing, I didn't. It was wetter than when it went out. Um, just currently in my bedroom, David is up there. So things have progressed quite a lot. He's painted all well three walls. I can't even count. Three walls, what? Um, got new grey wall, white wall here, and then we just need to, he's filled in all the cracks, that needs to be papered, and we're just trying to hang the curtains. And I think the house is built of steel gir girders because he's having struggling to put them in. Well, I'm a bit knackered now, aren't you? Mm. Yeah, um, in, my, in my PJs, really don't care. We had um, sausage casserole for dinner, which was really nice. Um, Harry Biker's recipe. Didn't want it to be the David and Die cooking show, so didn't film that. Uh, like I said, just in our pyjamas, Harry's had a bath, get ready for school tomorrow because it's back to school. Back to work for me, back to work for David. Normality is resuming, well, I say normality, the new normality of homeschooling, having a brew, having some pudding. What have you got? Chocolate. Chocolate dip. A chocolate dip from the uh, leftover from the 80s party. It's amazing. Yeah, if, you, if you've not had one for years, go out and get one because they are incredible. Watching a bit of Netflix, watching The People vs. OJ Simpson. I vaguely remember it from a few years ago, don't you? I vaguely remember a, a car chase and that's about it. It doesn't help that I don't know who all the people are, but seeing the Kardashians is a little bit odd. And that'll be it for Sunday. And then tomorrow I'm at work. And then Tuesday is my birthday. Not sure I mentioned it. I don't know how many we're up to on their birthday count, but it's my birthday on Tuesday. It's a big birthday. You've not mentioned it at least in the past 20 minutes. Yeah, at least the last 20 minutes I have not mentioned it's my birthday. You did mention my birthday. Uh, it's your birthday too, yeah. David's birthday, a big birthday in two weeks. So he needs to decide what he wants to do for his birthday. Not that we can do anything or go anywhere, but or what he'd like for his birthday. Puppy. Apart from a puppy or a camera, David's birthday list is over £7,000. That's not going to happen. All right, I'm going to leave it here for tonight and I will see you again either tomorrow or Tuesday. Birthday. See you later. Morning. Mm. Wake up. Bye. It's your birthday. Is it? Yes. <gasps> Thank you. Hello. Pretty balloons. Morning. Morning. Happy birthday. Thank you. <gasps> who says I'm 40? They said poo before. <laughs> Why is it? Because.
Oh, they're pretty. Oh, thank you. What's this? Is it orange juice or jungle juice? I think jungle. Oh, cool. Ooh, those muffins look really good. Oh, who's bought the Welsh cakes? And that was my decision. Your decision, was it? Yeah. Who wants the Welsh cakes more, you or me? Me. Okay. Got some jungle juice. Got some Prosecco. Cinnamon bun. Where's Chip and Dale? Pretend I'm at the garden grill then. You two are meant to dress up like chipmunks. Uh, Chip and Dale? Where's tater tots? <laughs> I'll go with the cinnamon bun then. Now at the garden grill, aren't I? Yeah. I've got Chip and Dale, cinnamon bun, and a jungle juice cocktail. Cheers, everybody. Oh, no, I shouldn't do that. Let down then. <laughs> Cheers. Oh, and also, we've got. What have we got? Sunrise at Animal Kingdom playing on the telly. Can I get in it? God, what is it? Just the right box. <gasps> oh, what is it? I know what box it is. <gasps> it's the Disneyland Paris one. Just double checking. Making sure it's the right one? Yep. Yeah. <coughs> oh, the collection's complete. Pass me the big one. Big one. I wonder what this is. No, sure, not sure what this one is. <gasps> Could it be a new coat? Didn't know this one was coming. Could it be a Disney castle? It could have been a Disney castle. Oh, thank you. Few hours since I left you when I had my breakfast. I opened the rest of my presents. I got a lovely coat off David and the kids, and a lovely mug from um, the kids as well from the Starbucks You Are Here range. So I completed my Paris collection. It's quarter past 12 and I'm still not dressed. I've been out for a run. Of course I have. It's my birthday. I run four miles, 4.0 for 40 to celebrate my 40th. Why not? Harry joined me for two miles, and then I did the last two miles by myself. David has wallpapered the wall upstairs and I'm getting him busy out there because he took the day off work today. So what else to do when you're in lockdown and it's your birthday? Some DIY. Woo! So rock and roll. So that was great weather today. Yesterday was beautiful when I was at work. Today the weather isn't as good as it has been. So I am just doing my table and chairs again and David is tackling the wicker set that we got. So I will go and show you that. Um, Need to think about lunch as well, not sure what I'm having for lunch. Having a nice takeaway tonight, Zoom call and a few bits tonight. So yeah, saw my mum this morning, she did a doorstep hello. Um, nice day, nothing else to do really in lockdown. We'll celebrate big style another day, but yeah. I'm having fun. I'm middle aged now, this is, what I, this is what I'm supposed to do, I'm not supposed to go out partying anymore. So I'm going to take you out and show you the chairs and stuff. So I've come inside, it's too cold and windy and it's the paint's just not coming off. I think it's because they're supposed to do it over a certain temperature. I wasn't having fun today. I wanted to just get ready and I suppose just chill out really. Lunch has arrived. We've ordered delivery. Every meal today is amazing. I have got a subway, so is David, and the kids is just arriving. Um another glass. Of fizz. Harry's just on a Zoom call. Then he'll have finished school for the day, pretty much. Obviously, I have some work to do. And Emily's got, doesn't finish till three, unfortunately. So I'm not sure what the rest of the day lies ahead yet. I'm gonna eat my lunch. Um, I'll catch up with you in a bit. 
So we're just heading out on a little bit of a walk. The kids have finished school. Um, heading to our sort of local village, meeting Grandad, and then walking back with Grandad because he is coming for tea, isn't he? Yeah. <coughs> Got my new coat on. Hold it. Yeah. Show it. Stay there. Stay there. New coat. Do you like? It's my new birthday present. Oh, I'm filming the floor again. Oh, sorry. That is my new birthday present. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna go for a quick coffee. Not had coffee yet since this morning. Get the kids out in the fresh air. This time yesterday was gorgeous weather, and today it's just a bit meh. Quite windy. David and Harry are playing with the radios. They're literally a couple of meters apart though. I just fixed it with the batteries. <laughs> I mean you were put batteries just, in it? Yes. Yeah. I'm playing with it with We've got Emily too, but she's all the way over there. My walk to the coffee shop plans changed a little bit because my brother had plans to come to my house for a socially distanced drink. Um, we ended up, they don't drive, so we ended up, because we were out anyway, we ended up driving to meet them and we went for a social distance walk down the canal, two metres apart. Um, I'll insert a couple of pictures now. Sorry David, you know you love me. So I got some lovely gifts off them. So it was like a kind of joint present. I got this cute little cup with my name on it, a Mickey and Minnie and a, a candle as well. Cheers, Jane. Thanks, Timo Sullivan. Um, so we'll leave a link down to their um, channel, amazing channel, and Jane's um, craft store as well. So she's got an Instagram page where she makes all these fabulous designs. So thanks for that, cheers. Love the hat. Um, we had a few bubbles walking down the canal, felt a little bit like a teenager drinking, walking down in the streets. Officially not on the streets, we're on the canal. So yeah, completely stay two meters apart. Yeah, a bit sad, I just wanted to give them both a cuddle and say thank you. And I got some, sorry, every time I hold this camera, my watch beeps, so, I got some amazing headphones off them for running, which I've been umming and ahhing whether to get for a long time. So I got those as well. I got a great candle. It was just lovely seeing them. We didn't want to leave each other. We were just chat chatting and chatting and chatting. It was getting colder and colder and darker. We just wanted to stay forever. I can't wait till we can meet at the end of April, I think it's supposed to be. Sorry. David has just gone to pick up some food. We're going to, um, a restaurant, I think it, a chain restaurant called Piccolino's. Um, Piccolino's um, is an Italian restaurant, obviously the best of a bad bunch. David and kids, you know, if you've followed us for a while, don't like different food. So they're having pizzas. Crazy Granddad's here, he's having steak and I'm having a carbonara and we've ordered a garlic bread as well. And then we're supposed to do a Zoom call with the family later. So fingers crossed that goes okay, because my mum is just not tech savvy at all. So that should be interesting. Um, had a lovely day. Made the best of a bad situation, but it's been absolutely lovely. So I can't wait for my dinner and some fo more family chats. Really looking forward to that. So gonna go off, finish my wine and eat my dinner when it arrives. I'll show you when it gets here. This is the current situation all over the floor and the sofa and the floor and the floor. It's everywhere. Birthday party cannon. Come on, Em, clean up.
So that is it. The end of my 40th birthday. I don't think I filmed as much as I intended to, but that's a good thing. I didn't pick the camera up all the time. It's important to have family time away from the camera, I think. Um, I don't really know what to say. I'm really tired. I want to go to bed. I have had a great but different day than maybe would have had previously in the past. You know what? Kids would have been at school. David and I would have done something during the day and then we'd have done something in the evening with the kids but it's been a bit of a different day today and that is absolutely fine because that's what just what it is it is what it is I've waffled for the last 60 seconds because I can see it on the timer and I apologize greatly I had a lovely day the 40th is finished we had a, a great meal a nice chat with the family a lovely birthday cake um Lots of mess with a confetti bomb. <laughs> Don't you laugh. Lots of mess with a confetti bomb, which you will have seen the aftermath of the confetti bomb. Um, lots of lovely presents. And yeah, it's been a lovely birthday. Um, and that's going to be it. I think this is going to be definitely a two part vlog. So this is the end of the second part of the vlog. Happy Sunday, everybody. Uh, please, please, please give us a big thumbs up. Go on. If you're watching on your telly, go back to your phone and give me a big thumbs up. Let's see if we can get in double figures this week for those thumbs up because I would really, 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 really appreciate it. Thank you to everybody that's subscribing. Don't forget to click that like button. Um, ding that bell for any notifications and I will see you again next week. Thanks for watching guys. Bye!